What's up everybody? I'm here with a video response to Sean Cop Blagarth. He has a video asking to show off your music shelves and how you store things. So uh, I figured it would be appropriate to make a video. What we're listening to currently is Black Bear Smoke with their Woods, Wire and Roses EP. Uh, this one's right here. Phenomenal. Awesome vinyl. It's a 10 inch. I'm not much of a 10 inch guy, but I genuinely love this band and I'm gonna see them on Saturday, so that's really cool. Uh, well, and this is what I used to listen to, but that's a, that's a different video. So, I, uh, I built my main shelf where I keep my vinyl and my tapes. So, I'm gonna show you that first and what I have uh, decorating such a thing. Uh, well, here it is. I've shown a video of this. One of the focuses, there you go. But this is it. Um, so what I got is this is all non-metal from where the camera is up. Non-metal tapes, you know, you see. You got like uh, Black Maternal Overdrive, Arlo Guthrie, Jeff Tall, Moody Blues, Queen, Steppenwolf, Pink Floyd, ZZ Top, Sex Pistols, all that kind of fun stuff. Yeah, uh, I keep them all in this. I accidentally made these too small. Uh, so they don't fit, you know. This is a Waylon Jennings tape, but it like it doesn't fit. <laughs> so that's that's fun. Uh, and then here is my metal tapes, all right in here. Now I built this in a slant sense, and then the vinyl's down here, and then there. So this is all my vinyl. Uh, the first part is. The metal right here is metal and then it gradually goes off into everything else I have mostly non-metal vinyl because I just prefer that uh, right there is it's just miscellaneous stuff you know there's like a towel there a, a goofy picture of Fenner is holding his stomach like he's pregnant there's a couple of books down there then right here I have some shoes and stuff uh, some CDRs that aren't yet put together another one of those towels and then right here is what I got up top uh, so this is basically all my metal tapes. This is all of my metal tapes. So what I got decorating it, I have what's a fingerboard, <laughs> like a like a wood one. Uh, flash drive accidentally sitting there. Candy bar that is probably too old to be eaten. Uh, some candles that are like real candles. Uh, my band's demo. A Tragunas sticker. My friend's band. Uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin. That will talk to you. And uh, a Slayer uh, shot glass. And uh, Stone Cold's here. Sorry, I'm shaking so much, guys. I don't know what's going on. But, uh, well, what I did here is because I was making listener copies for some albums. You know, just straight listener copies to listen to in my car. And uh, I made a ton that were too small, and I already printed them, so they're all here. So I got uh, Bathory with uh, Twilight of the Gods, or Twilight of the... I don't remember what that says. Uh, Martyr. I don't know that band, but I thought it looked cool. Uh, some Bathory, Unleashed, uh, a lot of Graveland, some Druk. Morta Scald, The Almond Brothers, Druk, Bathory, Birds and Bathory, Blasphemy, Druk, Proclamation, Druk, Sodom, uh, Heathen, Druk, Proclamation, Bathory, another Druk, Monstrosity, and Graveline. Uh, they're just all on there. I used packaging tape actually to put them on there. I think it looks pretty cool. It stays on there really nice, so that's, that's nice. Then here's all my vinyl. In here, uh, this can all be filled up with vinyl eventually. And uh, I'm running out of room. And these are to be put in a collection update. So I keep them there. I usually just, I don't know, I keep them there until I do the update. I usually don't overflow it because I don't buy too much vinyl. As you can see, I don't have that much. Yeah, I don't have too much, but yeah. And uh, well, let's think too. So now I'm going to take you to where I have my CDs. We're over here now. Uh, this is my CD setup right there. Uh, right here is all non-metal. 
I ran out of room. So this is all the stuff that's not metal. Oh, there's a portable cassette player and a portable CD player. Yeah, this is all stuff like ACDC, the Almond Brothers, and Aerosmith, Alabama, the band, uh, the Black Crows, Bob Seger, Boston, just a lot of classic rock, Frank Zappa, uh, some punk, just country, just everything. Oh, everything that's not metal is in here. And then this is just overflow because I don't have room. And here is my metal, my pride and joy of my collection. My metal. Uh, I have some of those thingies right there that, that hold tapes. I used to keep all my tapes in there, but I got too many. So what I got here, I used to have the Hate Eternal box set right there, but it's not there anymore. So I got the Shuther, uh, Antilvelia, or Antilv, I don't know how to say that name. The, the Die Hard, not Die Hard, the CD special box. Uh, some uh, blank tapes. Two books. Uh, and stuff for a collection update. Uh, I'll move that out of the way. This is actually all uh, blank cases right here. And then here is what's left of my band's demo. If you are interested in getting one, they're right here. They're free. Uh, when we debut our record, I'll just send them out with whoever buys one. So that's pretty cool, I guess. Uh, I do have them separated into genres. Here you have black and folk metal. All the way up until Zaster, and then you hit Anthrax, and that's Thrash, Groove, and uh, Sludge. Uh, all the way till it ends with Warbringer. Then you have Death Metal. All here. And then it ends with Winter Sun. Then you have uh, Heavy, Doom, and Stoner. Uh, starting with Sabbath. Or no, three inches of blood. Until you get right here, then it ends, uh, and then it goes into like new metal and metal core. Uh, starting with As Like Dying, and all these are new metal and metal core. Even though literally the only metal core that I have is um, As Like Dying. But yeah, uh, that's that's all of it, guys. That's my uh, whole setup. I got some posters and flags and stuff running around. I'll probably do a full tour at some point, but uh, yeah guys, that's everything. Uh, I keep the weird sized uh, cases with stuff, with everything else. See, there's a creator one, there's a Stryborg one. Those are really the only weird ones that I got. So um, yeah guys, uh, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, seeing where I keep all of my music, because uh, I built that right there and uh, I'm going to be building a bigger CD shelf soon when I get money because I'm currently building another guitar boat uh, yeah I can show those in another video but yeah guys uh, if this isn't very steady I my apologies if you um, yeah if you enjoyed the video thanks man uh, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day, and if you watch this cap thanks for watching, or anybody.